Though there are some greatest dams across the world which has been built against the furious water bodies in the recent centuries, there is also a dam which is known for its own miracle which has been hidden from the face of the history which dates back to the centuries. What if I say this dam was constructed 2000 years ago and which is found to be the world's oldest dam which is still in use which is none other than Kallanai which is also called as Grand Aniket. Kallanai is located in Tamil Nadu which is the southernmost part of the Indian Union which is present in the Trichy district of Tamil Nadu which is considered to be the part of ancient Tamil kingdom Chola dynasty. Cholas are considered to be the greatest kings of all the time just because they made the world realize the importance of the glorific Tamil language and their greatest architectures of all the time. Here we go. Kallanai was built by the great Karigala Chola who was one of the latest kings of Chola dynasty and is a great elephant warrior. The farmers at that point of time were so disappointed that during rainy season the mighty Kaveri river furiously destroys the agricultural lands and ultimately reaches the ocean due to the overflow of water and at the same point of time there will be a huge scarcity of water during the summer season. So King Karigala Peruvalatan after seeing the sufferings of the people decided to build a dam. Not exactly a dam because there wouldn't be even a concept of dam at that point of time but a plan in his mind to execute to save his people from poverty. But it's not an easy task to build a dam against the angry running Kaveri river with a water flow of 2 lakh liters per second. And ultimately he succeeded in it. So now let's date back to our childhood where we used to construct beautiful sand castles on the seashore using the sea mud. But these beautiful sand castles won't last for so long as it will be completely destroyed by the sea waves. Though the sea waves are less current in nature when compared to the mighty river waters, but still it reaches the sand and destroys the sand castles completely. Here is where our great Karigara Cholan uses his technology in constructing the dam called as Kallanai. The principle behind the Kallanai is very simple. They just drop some hard stones inside the water and due to the strong water pressure the stones have been pushed inside and in between the each stones an insoluble cement has been applied. And that's how Kallanai has been formed. It's still it's one of the strongest dams across the world. And the oldest too. Kallanai Dam which gave its golden hands to the farmers in developing the agricultural sectors of the nation by saving the crops from the flood during rainy season. And also saving the excess of water to the crops during droughts. This which earned the special name to the Chola Kingdom the heaven of agriculture. On other hand, Chola dynasty is considered to be the pearl house of valuable stones. In fact, the Mughal emperors are the highest importers of marble stones from Chola kingdom. In fact, the great Taj Mahal was built with some rare marbles which was actually imported from Tanjore which is considered to be the capital city of Chola kingdom. After so many centuries, Kallanai started losing its resource due to the scarcity of water and excess accumulation of sands. So, in 1839, Sir Arthur Catton, a British general, was appointed by British East India Company as an engineer to eliminate the excess of sand from the dam and to revive its ancient glories again. At that point of time, Sir Arthur Catton was just amazed with the basement given to the dam by the Chola King before so many centuries ago and to honor that he gave a special name to the dam the Grand Aniket. The significant part of 
Kallanai is the presence of the great Rasa Rasa Chola statue who is considered to be the powerful among all Chola kings who had influence on almost many parts of the world which also includes few Indian territories like Tamil Nadu, Andhra Pradesh, Orissa and few parts of Bengal which adds an extra honor to the dam. Kallanai is not just a dam for Tamil people but it's the temple where it depicts the wonderful culture of them including the greatest sages of all the time. If we find any dams which is being constructed in our daily life which is nothing but the reflection of Kallanai built by our great Karigala Cholan. So in memory of Karigala Perivadatan, Tamil Nadu government built a memorial with this brave statue inside posing like sitting on an elephant depicting the real strength of Kallanai and the architectural skills of Tamilans.